started off here in this building um, in about 1999. Uh, where I'm stood now was a cafe until uh, 2001, really, when the foot and mouth epidemic hit. And at that point, um, we suddenly found that we had no customers in the cafe and we needed to look at something in order to survive. And so we started making a few chutneys and relishes and jams to serve in the cafe and also to sell outside. And it started off with um, about three or four different products and we got that up to about 12 in, in the first few weeks. Um, today now we have about 138 different lines and um, more that uh, we'd like to make. We're just running out of space to do it. So um, it's definitely become more consuming really. About three years ago we moved to um, a beautiful 16th century barn just a mile from Hawkshead and it's a, a lovely idyllic setting right on the edge of Essway Lake and um, in there now we have all our offices, our kitchen production and warehousing so we can do everything all under one roof. Um, but it's still made by hand, it's still made um, using the same traditional methods, just bigger pans than we had before. We use a lot of things like um, blackberries and blackcurrants and, and all sorts of things that are available locally. And a lot of the products that we make feature damsons which grow um, really well here in South Lake. So um, it makes sense to use those things that are readily available on the doorstep. But we also make things like mango chutney, which obviously, you know, mangoes don't grow too well here. But, but we'll source them and buy them locally, so it just helps to keep the economy thriving locally. And um, that's very important to us. Hawkshead is a lovely little thriving community. And it, it, it is a lovely place in which to live and work. Well, Mark and I set, set it up together and um, he's, he heads up all the production and um, all the ordering and comes up with all the ideas. And if, we could, if somebody else comes up with an idea then he puts it into practice and creates the recipe. I deal with all the sales, marketing and finance and um, it works because I stay out the kitchen and he stays out the office. Um, but in amongst that we've got um, a couple that work for us in the kitchens and they work together. Uh, we've got other couple that work in the shop, again married couple that work together and it's people partly that we've known most of our lives and we all work really well together because we all have the similar feeling for what we're doing and we all um, are very enthusiastic about creating something really special.